Alright y'all, welcome back to another episode. Got all the gear loaded up last night, and uh, we made the trek up here to Delta Lake. Me and the brother-in-law Josh, you guys have all seen on the channel. Made the trek up here. Very damn cold this morning. I think the lowest we saw it was negative 7, but we got up here. There's a good maybe 12 to 14 inches of ice on here. We got the quad out here, Josh's quad. We ran two strings of tip-ups, target fish, this pike. Pickerel, maybe walleye, but pike is our main objective. Uh, target fish. We're running shiners and suckers on all tip ups, and uh, he's gonna dead stick a sucker in here. I'm gonna, I have a jig that we're jigging, but basically just gonna watch the tip ups for a while, and hopefully they start going off. We start catching fish. Y'all stay tuned. Cup of Joe. Cappuccino. Cappuccino. Thank you. That's gonna be smoking hot. Right? So I need to give it a couple minutes. Come on, flag, just go up. Once. Maybe more than once, but giant. One giant. And it's all I would, yeah. Don't matter who gets it. One giant. Pack it up and go home. <laughs> Might as well after that, right? I just want to catch a fish. We're right on the edge of where so they should be cruising. They should be hitting the edge of the main lake, too, you know? So it's not like they're going to be just back in there. But in the summer, they go up to the main lake? No, they're in, in the weeds, too. They love weeds. Yeah, you're getting it. You got him? Yeah. Nice. Dingo? Yeah, sort of. It's not bad. Hey, we caught a fish. There you go. <laughs> I wasn't going skunked. Pinch his head and throw him on a tip up for a giant, right? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> not bad. If we didn't have really? suckers, I would. You don't I mean, that. that is like perfect bait for these, for some of these giants, but we got good baits out there. Yeah. I just wanted to get some suckers that way, you know, I didn't want to get passed up by uh, by a nice pike that just didn't feel like a shiner was a worthy meal. Right. Well, there you always go. He didn't get skunked. That's all that matters. Not pitch worthy, but... Get back down there. There's another one. Is there? It might be better. Might be the same. Yeah. Just covering right off the bottom. Still right there. He's coming Seen right it for or us. He's found it. You're off the screen. You got him ready? I think so. No way. Yep. Oh my goodness. <laughs> wow, these guys are hungry, huh? Yeah. Jeez. Twofer. Twofer in about 30 seconds. They're freaking fighting too. Dude, that's the exact size perch right there that'll mess you up with fat heads or shiners on the tip-ups because right so I guess if we keep them occupied over here right they'll uh, they'll go hit them shiners get them halfway in their mouth take off with them set your flags and then you never catch a darn thing you'll be checking flags all day and you'll be hitting runs well I guess this one you keep sticking here those you're gonna be dead <laughs> percher here where the pike that's right where the walleyes well not the species we're after but we're catching them we're going back YouTube See ya. Your chances oh, fishing where the giants are. Otherwise, you're not gonna catch a giant. What? So you gotta take your chances fishing where the giants oh, are. Oh yeah. He's not mean, gonna catch one, you know. Right. If the species ain't there. You ain't gonna get it. I saw him chase it down like he's gonna hit it as soon as it hits the bottom. Put it in his mouth. I didn't even get the crank off the bottom, you know. All right, we're catching something. I wasn't gonna get scuffed. <laughs> Keep them occupied. They'll stay off those shiners too. Maybe draw a little attention as well, you know? Yep, yeah, we start getting school under there. And you'll bust through like the slushy shit. The main trails will run down enough. Then, uh, ooh, that's a nice perch. Get him, get him. Oh, oh, he snapped that. He ain't got it though. He got it, yep, yep. Um, <clears throat> and so then the main trail's like, oh, 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 I say too. Or you got me. Oh, I'm wrapping everything. Oh, yeah, that's a nice one. Um, so then he stayed on the main trail that was, it was pretty good. It was all packed down in the slush and frozen up and stuff. Well, number three perch, guys. Nothing crazy, but... Get down there, buddy. Yeah, you gotta find, yeah, there's a gap there in between there. <laughs> just, just swim out in there. Yeah. A whole new lake out here, guys. <laughs> guys? <laughs> guys? Yeah, for real. 
bitch. Where am I? <laughs> I'm lost. Not good. Can anybody hear me? Oh, I hope spring comes soon or <laughs> yeah, I'm <right>. done. <laughs> oh, this guy's coming for it. Let's see if I can feel the buddy. So, that's an, yeah, he's hitting, I think, right now. Got him. Oh, you got him. Sweet. So weird that I come up all turned. Right? Yeah. Something here. Just here. That one. Yeah. You got more spikes? Yeah. Throw a couple on here. You'll be able to see your bait a little better, too. I need to run as many as I can fit on there. Working on another one? Tiny little guy. Oh, flag up, flag up. Flag up. Really? Yeah. Just pop. Watch it pop. This wooden one right here. Good. So it took some line. Good. You get this one. No, you do it, man. Oh, that, 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 ain't, that ain't a perch. I don't know. I mean, this is a I hate these. I hate these. No. I think it took too much line to be a perch. Alright, All right, ready? So he's going that way, so as soon as you kind of feel him there, give him a good hook set. Remember, no rush, no rush, no rush. Take it easy. And if it pulls real hard, then let it go. But I'm guessing it's a small really pike light. or pickerel. Real light? Yeah. Keep pulling, keep pulling. He swims out the hole. Do you lose him? Nope, it's a big perch. Took a heck of a run. Nice perch. Yeah. I was going to say that at first, but the way it was pulling out line, I didn't think it was. I mean, look at all that line it pulled out. This I set that six feet down. Hey, we got a flag. Yeah, we not got a flag and through. a fish on it. Kind of expected that would happen with the with the shiners, though. Not what we're completely after, but it's not a bad perch. I'll take that as a good starter. I don't know, it started pulling pretty hard, and then I'm like, oh, I think I lost it. Got the good players. Hell yeah. Flag went off. <laughs> on the oldest tip off we have. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, they work. That, as long as you set it up right, you know. All right. It's definitely worked. It sucked if that was a bike because that gets, they get caught on these things back here. Yeah. That line doesn't, you know, it's got no, nothing to hold it. If you took a little piece of wire, what I would do, and take, drill a little hole here, drill a little hole here, and put a little piece of wire like this. So basically so holds it. So guides like that it. onto there, yep. So it can't come off the side because he's peeling drag and that line flops off the side of there. It's probably that big one we saw on the screen. Like you said, he disappeared. Real fat. I mean, not crazy long. Nice perch. But yeah. Probably like an 11, but real tall, fat. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Easy. Nice, man. All right. All right, get this guy back for Get down there. Yeah, there's pretty thick there. There. <laughs> there. Hit that ledge. Get down there. He's still on that ledge. There you go. Finally. See you, bud. Hey, you got a flag. That's all that really matters at this point, right? It'd be nice to get some sort of. Oh, I want a pickerel pike, too. I'm just saying, hey, flag went off, right? Makes your heart stop for a second. Huh? Tip, tip ups for nothing, and this is the biggest one so far. Yeah. Let's see if my rod's gone, buy a bigger one. That's pretty cool. We just saw this big one on the screen, guys, so could have been that one. But like Josh was saying, we have uh, four out of the ten that we have out are big suckers, so no little person can set that off. So if one of those go off, you know you got either a pickerel or a damn good sized pickerel or a decent pike. Hopefully a big pike too, but hey, catch and perch on tip ups and jigging. So. Can't complain. Next one's yours. I don't care if it's spinning like a giant pike or not, it's yours. That's how it goes. Like the first one, you take this second one. Still got time or what? We got an hour. Tis what it is. There it is. There we go. We got one. Not you got that one second. Just off the screen.
They're light colored. Yeah. I was gonna say that's the first one I pulled up. They don't. Real not smart either. No. <laughs> <laughs> Three in a row, one out there. It's not bad. No. The amount of time we had, at least we're catching fish. Yeah. Once one's fine. Perfect fish would have been alright. Feels like just a way to bait. No, it's small. It's gonna be a perch, I think. That's what it felt like the last time for me too. Yeah, no perch. Hey. At least we're setting it up, right? Yeah. Another fish. Not a big guy. <laughs> no. He stripped down that freaking shiner good though. Yeah, he did. Hey, let me get him. Definitely. Slipped right down in there. Oh, yeah. Oh. Big stuff. Hey, I said it was gonna be a last minute bite. Didn't say what it was gonna be. <clears throat> yeah. <clears throat> Probably got enough. Line to go right over there. What do the ones do? I mean, not perch do in general, I feel like. They just get and run. I guess. Oh well. Both on the wooden. The old, yeah. oldest tip ups we got out here. Okay. Both on the wooden. We're setting up last night. Yeah. The shiner buggy. These shiners pretty well dead. I don't think it's gonna spin them. I mean, you got a meal. Yep. I guess we'll pick that one up. Right? Or wanna reset? You said we had six minutes. <laughs> I know what six minutes means to you. It usually means 30 and then we're getting in trouble. Cruise across the lake. Yeah, we cruise. We probably get going 30. We'll be alright. Yeah. That's that's only Oh, my, oh, that's only two minutes off the list. <laughs> it's up to you, like I said. It's not my wife. Oh, no, I, I'm not going to be looking. <laughs> well, five months from now. That's right. Got shiners to use. Oh, well, we got a few more minutes, y'all. Um, Josh just reset that tip up out there up. Caught two perch. Didn't miss any on the tip up so far. And we only have about, probably about another 10 minutes to fish. We got some things to do. Aaron's run, so or Josh does, I should say. So we gotta pack it up, but we've been out here for a couple hours, and I mean the bite hasn't been there regardless. We caught some jigging, caught some on the tip ups, but um, I guess even if we sit here for another three hours, the bite could be the same, you know, one maybe every hour. So, but we got out here, we gave it a whirl, and uh, that's all you can do. We we're targeting that one decent or big size pike, maybe a nice size pickerel. It just didn't work out yet. Maybe that last, last second bite, we'll get them, but I'm going to get some things packed up here in a few minutes, and hopefully another flag goes off. I'll see you guys then. Yeah, we're stuck. Ish. All right, y'all, just got off the ice. Uh, we almost got stuck there before I had to hop off. You guys got a little bit of the GoPro footage that had to rock back and forth. Tried taking a little shortcut. Got stuck in about two feet of snow there. But we came, we saw, we didn't conquer. Uh, we caught some fish, of course, but we knew going in that it was either going to be no pike or, you know, you're going to get that one on the tip up, maybe two decent ones. And uh, I mean, that's the percentage chance you have. I mean, you still got to go out and try it for sure. But it was fun. Still caught some nice perch. Really, if we wanted to, we discussed this. I mean, if we wanted to, we could have ate them. But I mean, there was definitely eaters there. And we just already have enough fish in the freezer so it was fun definitely we'll go back and try it again maybe not this year but next year get there in the summer yeah hit there in the summer maybe we'll pull a pike through in the open water but let us know in the comment section down below what you guys have been catching we've been struggling pretty uh pretty bad this year so if you guys are having a good year you know let us know, let us know in the comment section down below that what you guys have been catching be sure to subscribe leave a like and i'll see you guys in the next one